of tremendous growth for Ford. And for me, seeing this strong growth for our company is truly gratifying, especially as we approach the 150th anniversary of my great-grandfather's birth. Henry Ford's vision for this company from the start was to grow by serving people, by applying ingenuity not only for profit, but also to move the world forward. My great-grandfather wanted to make high-quality and reliable vehicles that were affordable for the average family so that everyone could enjoy the freedom of mobility. He felt his company's products should also create jobs, improve people's lives, and help drive the economy. Today, we live in a much different world, but Henry Ford's legacy and vision live on. With our products, we still put an unexpected level of technology within reach of millions of people. And we're still driving growth by creating jobs and bringing the freedom of mobility to the world. In 2012, we saw growth in nearly every aspect of our business, delivering 25 new vehicles around the world. This year, we're excited to extend that profitable growth as our commitment to having the freshest products continues. In fact, the average age of our global product lineup improves dramatically this year by nearly 10% compared with last year. To deliver all those new products, we're creating thousands of new jobs. In the U.S. this year, we're hiring more salaried employees than we have in more than a decade. And in China, we'll double the size of our salaried workforce. Plus, we're building and expanding capacity in four growth markets. Henry Ford would be proud of what we're doing and how Ford is growing. And with every new vehicle we sell, with every new market we enter, and with every new job we create, we carry out his vision for making people's lives better. Today, we're going to show you more new vehicles that will build on our success, serve our customers all over the world, create jobs, and drive our continued growth. Now here to tell you more is our President and CEO, Alan Mulally.